All right. You definitely learn something new every day. I'm a firm believer in that. And uh, today's video, uh, I was completely unaware that the uh, Linux PC manufacturer, System76, has its own operating system. I was uh, looking around on DistroWatch, and it appears that uh, System76 um, has uh, an OS called Pop OS, and I'm looking at their 1810 desktop. Of course, this is a fresh installation, and uh, upon installing this, uh, you are greeted with this screen. Now, I've never looked at this before, was completely unaware of it, so uh, you'll be experiencing this at the same time that I do. So we've got a welcome message, and it's, it's appearing in several different languages. Okay, and the first question, it wants to, uh, it wants to verify that we've selected the correct keyboard layout because the installer gives you an option to um, choose which layout you want. Okay, and then of course uh, you can either allow or not allow them to uh, allow the OS uh, location services. You select your time zone where you are in. Then it's going to ask you to connect all of your um, social networks and that sort of thing. We're going to skip that because I don't do that sort of thing. It's going to ask you for your full name. So you can create your user account. We can set a password. Okay, and then we can uh, start using this. Okay, and uh, here we are, ready to rumble here. All right, well, this is using the standard GNOME desktop. Um, the icons in the upper right give you some options here for um, managing uh, your uh, internet. Uh, this is your, uh, your battery indicator, and I assume this also has your, yep, your power settings can be managed here as well. Okay, and then, of course, you can log out and select your account settings. Then a quick launch to your settings as well. And everything in the OS can be managed from here. Uh, Bluetooth preferences, if you have any Bluetooth devices. Uh, background preferences. Let's see what we got here. Okay, a number of wallpapers are thrown in. Uh, very nice. Notification preferences. I hate notifications. Search preferences in the software that's pre-installed. Region and language preferences. Universal uh, access. If you want larger text, you can have that. And with a high screen resolution, that's not a bad idea. I have a uh, larger text on my screen as well because uh, I have we're, we're viewing this in full 1080p. Uh, high contrast if you need it. Personally, I don't like how that looks, but for some people, good thing there. Okay, it looks like they have an on-screen keyboard, do they? Oh, very nice. I like that. Okay. So you can turn off or turn on a screen keyboard. That is pretty cool. Um, looks like they've got zoom options, a screen reader. Cool stuff indeed. Okay. Uh, another option for connecting online accounts if you change your mind. Privacy options. Uh, your sharing options if you're sharing files over the network. Sound options. Power management. Networking. Manager devices. Okay, and it looks like we've also got uh, system details. Okay, very good. So far, I'm impressed with what we've got here. We click activities here. This uh, appears to be, uh, when I was looking at the live system, this appears to be a um, nice little OS that you can build on top of quite easily. 
Okay, so we uh, a quick launch to uh, Firefox. Um, your uh, file manager terminal and the pop shop. Okay, so it looks like they've got their uh, little software repository here, so you can add additional tools to extend this operating system's functionality. And uh, here are all the tools that this pretty much uh, has uh, loaded into it right now. Looks like it also gives me some options to uh, install uh, other things. I didn't need to, though. Uh, this automatically detected my screen resolution and set that up for me, so that's all good to go. And um, this has all the applications in here that are already installed. But you can install other things as well. Okay, cool deal. I like how this looks. Very nice. And I would expect a nice OS like this from System76 as well. Um, and if you want to support Linux, you know, um, you should consider maybe in the future when it's time to upgrade to, uh, to go to a company like System76 to get a computer that already has Linux installed on it. At least then you're going to know that all the hardware and everything uh, is going to work with this. All right, so as stated, just the basics comes loaded with this, so you can easily build on top of it, and you don't have to uninstall a bunch of applications, you know. So you just got the basics here, a calculator, calendar, uh, you can manage your contacts, your uh, file manager, Firefox for web browsing. Let's take a quick look at this. I want to see if... Um, System76 has, you know, if they have uh, any links to System76 for support on this. Um, let's go into their uh, preference to um, bookmarks here. Where is, oh. Just goes to show you how often I use Firefox now. I still can't remember. All right, and they've got some links to help you get started with this. So, um, since this is an Ubuntu-based distribution, you know, it's it makes sense that they would have ubuntu related links i'm just surprised that we don't see a link to uh, system 76's pop page here that's okay though they're easy enough to find on the internet so i just wanted to make sure that they had at least uh the uh, links and everything that you need uh for getting the most out of this all right now let's close those tabs and continue right along here Okay, uh, you have Geary, an office. You have the full LibreOffice suite thrown in. We've already looked at the Pop Shop. Um, we've already looked at the Settings Manager. A terminal, a simple text editor. handful of other utilities are thrown in, so if somebody sends you a zip file, you'll be able to open it. You'll be able to read your PDF files. Um out of the box on this, some extra fonts thrown in. Uh, even has um, USB drive creator, uh, video player, simple scanner. So pretty much this will cut up most things that you throw at it um, until you're ready to open up the software center and uh, extend its functionality with new applications and features. Um, I'm impressed. This looks pretty cool, and I never even knew System76 had its own OS, so this was a real treat to have a look at this. Uh, good news to see this on uh, DistroWatch this morning, and so I figured, all right, I'll download a copy of this and have a look at it, and um, hey, what can I say? It looks neat. Um, now, this is an 1810 release, so I'd imagine that um, they're shipping uh, LTS uh, releases. Uh, so this is kind of an in-between release, if I'm not mistaken, where they've uh, applied additional patches and that sort of thing. Gives you a taste of what will be coming up in the very next LTS uh, uh, distribution that comes up. If you think this is an OS that you would like, there'll be a link in the description where you can click on it and uh, get a copy of it. And while you're there, uh, have a look around at System76's many off offerings that they have uh, for um, PC. And uh, if you're in the market to get a new PC, that is a good place to have a look. There are many places to go online, though, for, um, 
or Linux preloaded, but System76 is the one that comes to mind uh, whenever I think of uh, people who are manufacturing computers with Linux pre-installed, and I think that's common knowledge for everybody. All right, well, that's all I have on today's topic. I'm not sure what I'm going to be covering next on Cup of Linux, uh, but I'm sure I'll have something equally exciting uh, tonight at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, uh, UTC negative uh, 5. Um, Cup of Linux game night is coming back, and we're hoping to have this every Saturday night at 8 p.m., and uh, so please... Uh, Visit us at cupoflinux.com and uh, click the chat button. It'll give you instructions on connecting to us on Mumble. I have some free Steam keys to give away. I'm going to give away two of them tonight. Uh, so two ga two lucky winners uh, will uh, win some free games tonight. It'll, it should be a lot of fun, so I hope to see all you there. Until next time, peace out. <music>